Jar Jar Binks needed to be diced more finely. Get some of these stumps up. Okay. Where are we going? Alright, okay, let's swap out that. Let's get some bunnies to murder. We picked up those flowers. No mistake that. Okay, alright, another one. Okay, so that's two bunnies for the pot and some seeds. So still not a great haul. None of these are really grown enough yet. Let's have another quick run around these. Traps, nothing. See, I'm feeling traps four and five being built to be to, uh, well, five and six to be honest with you. It's, it's very sad when everyone dies, but uh, when someone is popular, when somebody has a following, it just makes it worse. I think it's uh, oh, I, I, I understood. For example, all the out out cry when Robin Williams had died. Yeah, okay, none of us have gone to watch a film he'd been in for years. But, he... Oh, dogs, joy. Let's get away from them. He, he just made people's lives better. Um, my childhood... For example, growing up in the 70s was very, 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 very much um, influenced by Mork and Mindy. So, yeah, uh, a lot of my oddball sense of humour, if you can call it such, is down to Robin Williams' jokes affecting me when I was five years old. Hello, Frankie524. Okay, one, two, three bunnies. That's not enough for the crock pot. None of this is grown. Okay, so we'll give it a little while, make it get darker, and then we'll light another fire. And we'll just cook and eat this stuff that's the old fashioned way. So we've got three bunnies and some seeds. It's not bad. And. Yeah, we'll make another trap or two and go looking for poop in the morning. Uh, I've got, do we have enough wood now? We've got 19 wood. Oh. Not a good sign. Okay, so. One, two, three. And one more. That lets these us with two logs that'll get us through the night. Where's me electrical doodads? There's me electrical doodads. And that should be enough to make us an alchemy engine. Excellent. Yeah, and that'll open up a load more recipes for us, stuff to make. So, right, let's. Indulge ourselves in some bunny slaughter. Thanks, Tanny, and uh, and welcome to the channel. I don't think I've said hello to you yet. If I have, well, hello again. Uh, right, morsels. Yes, yes. I thought he was he was great. He was on the ball. He was just so good at what he did. Didn't want to put that on, but it was the first thing I grabbed. I got nice big fire.
Right, okay, that's got our food level back up again. What are we talking about? We're talking about Robin Williams. As opposed to Robbie Williams, who's totally different. Good film, excellent film. Yeah, that was that was more Robin Williams than Mrs. Doubtfire. That was that was a bad film. That was a very bad film, to be totally honest with you. Right, I want a spear. So what I want. Alright, so for a spear I need twigs, flint and rope. And rope we can make. Let's make some rope. And now let's make ourselves a spear. There we go. It leaves. This has a luxury axe and Opulent pickaxe, a regal shovel, and a pitchfork. Okay, how are we doing? Right, it's nearly, nearly daylight, so we need to get ready to start running around. But let's have a quick look at the stuff we can make. Now. Your hats, a top hat. Oh, a rain hat. Now that looks interesting. Beaver pelts, okay, yeah. Right. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Right. Okay, let's think. What do we need? I want to get some wood. We're getting short of wood, and I want to get some poop because we need another farm or three. And if we can pick up some grass on the way through, that is also excellent. So I think that's the plan for today. We go this way, and then we go south. Go! Have those seeds as well. <laughs> yeah. George Carlin was also an excellent, excellent comedian. Um, I've been watching. Um, a lot of stuff on uh, British Radio 4 Extra, which is, it does a lot of old radio comedies and things like that, and... Okay, most of you guys have probably heard of Monty Python. Oh, it's gone. We lost another axe. Okay. Let's make another axe quickly. Um, what people don't know... Is is that um, th there was another group called the Goodies, who were Bill Oddie Graham Garden, Dr. Graham Garden, and uh, Tim Brooke Taylor. And the Monty Python team and the, the Goodies team, before they became Monty Python and Goodies, did a lot of radio comedy together, and some of it is absolutely excellent. Um, they did one series called, I'm sorry, I'll read it again, which is uh, you know, just radio sketch comedy, which is just completely insane. And um, you know, little stories like you know, it was six o'clock in the morning, and down in the harbour the whaling ships are heading out to sea. They don't want to go. And um, you, know, you can see see where all this this comedy and all the all this this stuff. Why don't you like me? Oh dear, is it? It's it's beefalo breeding season, is it? Ah, look, their tails have gone... well, their bums have gone red. <laughs> right, so let's carefully gather some poop. Right, okay. Departure from our normal insanity. I have got to attack a penguin. And that is what a touchstone does. And there's all my stuff. Let's go and get my stuff. <laughs> oh, 
Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. And there's my skeleton. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> right, okay, it's clearly going to be getting cold now. Alright, okay, I'm heading back up to base. We need to think about this. Why did I kill a penguin? Because it was there. Because they were new and I wanted to see what happened. And I saw quite quickly what happened. Very quickly became an ex Wilson. Oh, very bush. How are we doing? Right, let's go and have a quick look at these snares and perhaps make one or two more. Nope. Jumped in right on cue there. Very good of you. Those two have grown. That's excellent. We are starting to freeze, so we're going to have to do something about that. I'm a big fan of the Batman movies. Uh, okay. Um, which set? The 1980s ones or the Christopher Nolan ones? And yes, I think Ber 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 uh, Ber Ber Meredith Burgess, isn't it, um, or something like that, was uh, the the best penguin there ever was. All right, kill the rabbit. Kill the rabbit. Grab that. Grab that. Grab any seeds. Oh dear, stick something in the fire. So let's try actually putting it in the fire pit rather than near this time. There we go. There, let's warm things up a little bit. Plant some seeds. Okay, and let's stick stuff in the crock pot. Yep, you can make a winter hat, that'll keep us warm. Make a thermal stone as well. And I think we're going to need to start looking at this stuff. So, rabbit earmuffs. Need two rabbits to make rabbit earmuffs. That actually seems like a good investment. Hello, Gay Shell. Welcome back. And I think we really need to start looking at structures as well. Right, we can make something. We can make a hay wall. Yeah. Uh, I mean, yeah, okay. Alright, the, the, the 1980s and the Christopher Nolan ones, they both had their... Excuse me. They both have their strengths and their weaknesses, but um, I personally just absolutely adore the sheer campiness of the 1980s ones. Drop to some of the old shows as a kid in the 80s: the Batman, the Adams Family, and the old black and white Zorro. Added monsters, and yes, that's pretty much the stuff that I used to look at uh, on uh, as a kid as well. So, okay, Michelle, what's up with your iPad? Not that I'm offering you customer service in any way whatsoever. But, uh... Oh, we, should, we should share the pain. 
Okay, things wandering around in the shadows. That's not good. Okay, so let's go up near these guys and let's see what we can make. Let's do this a different way. Go, go, go over there. Go over here. There we go. Straw hat to keep me cool. Garland. Sewing kit. Top hat. Rain hat. Rabbit ear must sound good. Beefalo hat. No, we're not going to do one of those soon. Winter hat. Right, you see why I was so happy to see the spiders? Because these webs are used for just a fashion <laughs> I don't want to know. Ice cube, beekeeper hat, feather hat, bush hat, plain coat, damper vest, breezy vest, puffy vest. Right, long and short of it is we can't actually make any of this stuff yet. But it'd be good if we could. Oh, stop doing that. Alright, okay, that's fire will probably see us through the night, so let's keep on looking out around. And press the hatitator. Don't want to know. Papyrus for writing things. Don't make any of that yet. Right, so yeah, we just want to look at things that possibly keep us warm. Well, there is actually one. I think it's in. So, five, oh, possibly. I'm better. Honey poultry things. So, I'm just stick some stuff on the fire. A lot of stuff on the fire. I can see this is not going to be easy anymore. Right, uh, yeah, our sanity is going south for the winter, really, isn't it? Thermal stone is what I'm looking for. Thermic fire stick, minor hat. Minor hat is interesting. Come on, where is it? Uh, I'm, because I desperately need to go and start getting some food. Right, okay, we'll look at that later on. Right. to say I'm feeling dumb about anything. You know what you know. Just see what I say. We come here we go. Etc. Etc. I can't remember the rest of the song. It's things that I do in the back of my head. There we go. I know what I know. I sing what I say. We come and we go. That's the thing that I do in the back of my head. I know what I know. Yeah. Oh. Desperately need food. Come on. You're just gonna have to tough it up for a little bit. We just need to get some food. Get some bunnies in traps or some berries or whatever. All this running around should keep you warm if nothing else. Alright, okay, let's get some. Some traps built, if nothing else. Start putting them down because we're not catching enough yet. There's some more. Yeah, this is not helping us in the slightest, really, is it? Alright, that's all. Eek! Gone!
Oh. Ah. Oh. How much time we got? We got about 25 minutes. Let's make a new character, shall we? Let's retry to. Does that allow us to pick another character? Let's just put straight back in. That puts it straight back in. Okay. We'll do another Wilson one. Next one will be a different character. Anyone watched Home Alone? I watched about half of it and gave up in disgust, to be honest with you. Miss Money, hello, welcome to the chat. Uh, tempted to say hello to Raven Sarah again because it knows her when I do. So, yeah, hello, Raven Sarah. Yeah, 22 days, wasn't that bad? No way of uh, uh, working out how to deal with the cold, so that's going to have to be something we're going to need to learn. Let's just do the normal I'm running around like mad picking things up thing at the moment. Yep. Yeah. Certainly hope it would be. Hello, Dad. Nicole, hello. Welcome to the chat. Seems like yesterday since I spoke to you last. Oh, I want to do nasty things to that turkey. Some of them involving cranberry sauce. Loads of grass, excellent. So, looks like these are these rabbit holes. Collapsed rabbit hole, interesting. Okay, so let's have a quick run around and see what we find. Some flint would be good so we can make some tools. Some gold would be excellent so I can make a um Yeah, science machine. Brain stalled for a second there. Yeah, I wonder why. I wonder why that is. In case anyone's wondering from the usual crowd, Mandarin Wound sends her apologies, but she's not feeling too well today. So, uh, hopefully we'll see her next time. Okay, that's, uh, yeah, that's probably enough of that for now. Let's go and have a quick run around and see what else we can find. Great, thank you. Very kind. Um, I'm certainly going to be doing lots and lots of them, so, uh, probably a good thing you like them. I'm going to start thinking about the, do, what I'm going to do for Christmas. And I want to get that sorted out over the next couple of days. Right, this isn't going to go well. Can I make anything fire related yet? I like a torch. This might be a very short run, guys. I haven't found any flint, and I can only make a torch. And we're getting soggy. Let's stick. Come on, give me a torch. Uh, give me a, a flint. Give me just one flint. Come on, I'm not being greedy here. It's the one. Oh, green my Oh! We might survive after all. Let's get some trees chopped down while we still got a chance. Thanks for the protection of the elements tree while I'm cutting you down. I'm probably going to do a giant Christmas tree. I'm probably going to do a giant Christmas tree. Um, if only because it's relatively easy to do. And there's lots of other things to do I want to do, but yeah, that's probably going to be the case. I was originally thinking about doing something like a giant sleigh, but quite frankly, even all the other things I need to do over the next few weeks, I don't think I'm going to have enough time coming up to Christmas to do anything too sophisticated. 